Hey, Rock Point Church family, I have been waiting for months to do this video that's going to say that we're going to reopen church. And I mean, we're going to reopen the whole thing, kids ministry and everything. And we are super excited about that and can't wait to get you back in the building finally after all of these months. So here's some things that you need to know that are very important. According to the governor's executive order last week, um, we have met with the Montgomery County Health Department, uh, submitted our plan for reopening, um, and they have accepted our plan and told us that we are good to go. So here's some details um, that I think are important for you to know. Number one, we have three different levels of cleaning that we do weekly um, in our church these days. So we have our team that cleans, we have an outside team that comes in twice a week and cleans the facility as well. And then we also have an organization that comes in and sprays the facility to make sure that we're doing everything we can to make sure we kill the virus if it were to happen to be in here. And so we are taking extra precautions every week to try to make sure this place is clean and it's sanitary. So that's one thing. The second thing is this, we have reconfigured the auditorium the venue and all of our children's classrooms so that we can sit people socially distance um, and accom accommodate all of that. And so, uh, so we want you to know that when you come in, um, our rows are six feet apart. Um, we're asking families to sit uh, so many chairs apart, all of those kind of things so that we can do uh, social distancing the very best way possible. The next thing I wanna tell you is this, Sundays, um, when you get ready to come, uh, you no longer have to register to come to our worship services. But we would ask you to register your children ahead of time. Go to our website, just click on the register there and register them so that number one, we know how many kids are coming. And number two, we can make sure our classrooms are set and we have the amount of teachers that we need uh, to be able to accommodate each different classroom and how many kids are gonna be in that classroom. So when you come on Sundays, um, here's what's gonna happen. As you come up to the door, we're gonna have people there with thermometers to make sure we take everybody's temperature. And according to the CDC regulations, if your temperature is over 100.4, um, we will kindly and lovingly ask you to return home so that you don't come in and get anybody else sick and so that you can go home and take care of yourself. This is the kind of thermometer we're gonna be using. Lucas, come on in here for a minute. It's super easy, it never touches anybody. It's just like this. And it will give me the reading and uh, we give you the thumbs up and then you are good to go. And uh, so it's super easy, it's super fast. We're gonna have three of these at each entrance uh, so that we can make sure that people are coming and going, but we're gonna be doing this with everybody that enters the building, adults, children, infants, it doesn't matter who it is, to make sure that we're being the very safest that we can be as people come into our worship center. And then let me talk about masks for a minute. Um, according to the governor's executive order uh, and the Montgomery County Health Department, um, they highly encourage um, that people wear masks when they're out in public and so forth. But for religious institutions, it is not mandatory that people wear masks if we can do social distancing and do that well. And so as you come to church on Sunday, um, if you would like to wear a mask, if you feel better wearing a mask, you certainly can, and that is absolutely fine. If you decide that you don't wanna wear a mask and you wanna to come to church, you are not required to wear a mask either. It's not mandatory, but it is encouraged that people do that and, uh, and help out in that way. So our foyer areas are big enough, our auditoriums, our children, our venue, everything is set up for people to be able to stay the appropriate distance away. So masks are not, um, they're recommended, but they're not mandated. So it's your choice in what you would like to do in wearing a mask or not wearing a mask. So again, we are super excited to have you here on Sunday. We can't wait to get things rolling again, get our church filled up, uh, have the, the fellowship, the social contact. I mean, all the things that we so much desire but have been missing for all of these months, we can finally do that once again and do it safely. And if we didn't think we could do it safely, we wouldn't be opened yet. So we hope to see you on Sunday. 
Get online, register your kids, show up, and it's gonna be great. We're looking forward to seeing you then.